So this video today is just to do a little quick review on probably my favorite top. My favorite shirt that you can buy from any brands out right now. And that would be the shirt that I'm wearing here. You can see with the nice logo here, Brahma Bowl. And yes, it's Under Armour. So, um, when it comes to a top, and especially at the gym or summertime, you know, a regular t-shirt's nice. You got a graphic shirt, nice designs, there's a ton of that. But I like something that lets me feel really free. And I've looked around to a ton of sites, and all I found was like, um, you know, Squat Wolf or uh, Gymshark. They have little stringers. But I want something with more substance than that, not just a little piece of string to wrap around. Yeah, that's nice and loose. But when I came across one of these about over a year ago, Man, these made a difference. Two reasons. First reason is the con material is just very flexible, very light. Warm enough that it keeps you warm, but picks up the sweat, being thick and all. But number two is, it's a sleeveless hoodie, and the hood's got pull strings, it comes over, you want to do squats, you get, I mean, with someone with like me, long hair, I usually have to tie my hair with a tie and put it up. But sometimes, you know, you just want to throw this over quickly, the, the hood helps. You know, you want to warm up a bit more, it's, you want to get that Black Adam look, speaking of that, I'll show you the other one soon, but yes. Yeah, so, when it comes to a t-shirt, this Under Armour sleeveless tank, they're my favorite, and almost all the time, unfortunately, they're from the Project Rock line, so they range, I forget, anywhere from $40 to $65 Canadian. But, uh, you know, you can look at your Under Armour factory outlet for sales. I know I've definitely got a few from there. So, first off, this color, this was the second color I got out of them. They keep it pretty plain and simple with monotone colors and design. So, let me go to the first one. So, the first one I got at all was this one here I believe yes so you can see it same as the one I'm wearing now you got the Brammable logo pull ties you got a little bit of a saying at the back you know iron paradise I definitely don't look like an iron paradise worker you know I still got some years on me to put some muscle on and you also got a little logo down here I don't know if it's zooming properly but that's pretty much the designs cut off Basic and simple. Now, when it goes for sizing in these, I'm about six foot, 160 to 75 pounds, making it there, and um, I go for a medium. Most of my shirts I buy medium if it's snug and large is what I like if it's a little looser. But you know, this has no sleeves, nothing to hold you up under the armpits. So I figure go the smallest size that you normally wear, just so you know it's nice and loose and free. If you go too big, it's gonna be all weird and baggy. So. This was the first one I bought, and I fell in love instantly. I used it outside in the summer all the time. The gym, I go on days on days wearing this without washing it. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know, comment below if you guys think that's gross or not, or it's a shirt. If it doesn't stink, who knows? But anyways, too much on that. Bought this one, wore it for a long time. It was waiting for more to come out. Then this one I got on clearance. Someone returned it from online, it looks like, at an Under Armour outlet, and was able to pick it up for at least half price or less. Then again, I walked in another day a couple months later, and I saw, you know, they had more. So I went, it's not the same, and bought a second one. Now, over time, you can see, as I wash this a ton, the black has faded a little bit. But that's expected, you know, it's not going to look nice and crisp. So I had this one, I had two black ones, and then the Project Rock Black Adam movement came out, you know? So um, I had to jump on that one. Now this one's a little more... It goes a battery. This one has a little more detail to it. You got that anti-hero on the front. It's a little nerdy. I'll admit that. But hey, I gotta support the, the multi-millionaire because he definitely needs more money, you know? But anyways, no. I'm supporting what I like on my body. And that's, that's the main thing. Not the brand of how this feels. And, and there's the back of it. So in total, I have one, two, three, four. I'm pretty sure I have a fifth some, one somewhere. I just can't find it. But that's pretty much it. So, once again, yeah, this shirt. Uh, the back of this one, I don't think anyone, but I'm not going to do a stand-up and show because this is just a nice little quick video to show you guys my personally favorite Under Armour item, my favorite top, my favorite sleeveless. Now, the final thing is I want you guys to tell me if you know of any brands that have like a nice cut top like this um, with a hood or anything or any other designs, comment below because I want more of these. It's, it's my favorite thing to wear. Other than that, yes, I know there's a bunch of Under Armour, or it's not Under Armour, YouTube videos that have do-it-yourself, you know, you take a t-shirt, you cut it off, but I want the seams, the ending, to not be frayed, you know, they, they kind of had the proper, it's not a stitch, it's just, 
It's not going to fray material, you know? Anyways, too much talking. Sorry, guys. Tell me, do you like these shirts? Do you have some? All that stuff, comment below. Like, subscribe. Give me to a thousand. We almost there for watch time hours, so let's go. Till next time, guys. Take it easy.